Oh wow, look at that resemblance. We just need to put a hat on him. Give us your best cowabunga. Cowabunga, dude. Is that pretty good or no? Rate my cowabunga in the comments. What's up? Welcome to the channel, guys. Today we are throwing the motor in the Evo 10, or at least we will attempt it. But first I want to time it since we have it out. So this is Rodney. He's actually a Sagittarius. He enjoys long walks on the beach. But also working on these motors. Tell us a little bit about this motor, Rodney. Garbage, I hate it. All right. Well, it's trash. I actually pick it up and throw it right into a dumpster. This is the motor that will be going into this car. Cool. Uh, oh just, no. Let's just pull the valve cover here. How's it coming along? That's how it's coming along. Two thumbs up. Cool. A million bucks? A trillion? A trillion bucks? Good thing I have no idea what size those corroded bolts are. Think so? Mm-hmm. <laughs> the other one's moved, but that one didn't. The tensioner is broke. Well, the tensioner was already broke. It's a tension. One? Yeah. Oh, is it, or is it just loose? Already? No, it's not moving. Yeah, well, I'll just have to replace it because clearly this tensioner is not doing its job. Cowabunga, dude. Count the cowabungas with me. Cowabunga counter? Yeah, you're gonna put that in the video, the cowabunga counter? Yeah, might as well. Yeah, might as well. <laughs> Can we put me mocking you in the video too? Yeah, might as well. <laughs> yeah, is that how you're gonna do it? Yeah, just like that. Wow. You can add that in there. Okay. Yeah, might as well. <laughs> ah! Oh, we got to take apart the engine to put it back together after we retime it. This looks pretty good. I don't know if I need to touch anything, but... How many miles did this engine have? 88,000. Do you looks... think it was done at 60? Or do you have to do it at 120 when it's on a timing chain? I don't know with the Evo 10s. Probably 60K is my guess. Should we do a quick Google search? Why? Do we want to act like we know it all? Oh, I've been working on these for so long. Well, you have. I know everything. <laughs> Not everybody knows everything. When, this, when did this car come out? Hmm? Well, like 09? 08. 08. I made them 08 to 15. How many have you had? A lot. I've never personally owned one, though. I mean, I, I guess I have owned them, but I... Never daily drove one, but we'll daily drive this one after we get it done, you know? Yeah. Why not? Need to drive something cool, right? Yeah. This will, this seems like it'll be like reliable and a little bit newer. Will it be reliable though? Will it be? It's a Mitsubishi after all. Success? Success. Success! Great success! You guys like my cool chain? Like this? I'm just gonna start wearing it everywhere. Your awesome chain? Yeah. Come with me as I go to Costco every day and eat a slice of pizza. I'll live stream it. You should start doing that every day, just getting it. Live stream pizza. a slice of pizza for no reason? Right to TikTok? Yeah. Bro, yeah. why is this guy? It'll be every, every day at 11, he gets a slice of pizza and live streams and eats it. For no reason. 
pretty weird, dude. I'm about to look up how often timing on these things should be done. Never, never. This is a good angle right here, top view. Top view. All right, tell us your life story. I don't have one. So I was you are, born, you I was are born Rodney in, I was born Jr. In lab. Rodney Jr. Do you was, ever just get called Jr.? No. No. That tensioner is on there and it's stuck. What's up? Welcome to the channel, guys. Today we are throwing the motor in the Evo 10, or at least we will attempt it. But first I want to time it since we have it out because I don't know the last time it was done. It's going in here. No, it's not. Psych. It's going in this one, right here. Lies. He's lying. No faith. Well, I got faith, but this ain't a junkyard. Is that how it goes? You could tow this across the finish line. <sighs> no sh 4B 11T, buddy. like a Myvex sensor shield. Oh God, that was on there. This guy here, pop the cover off with this guy. What do you think? I don't know where to start. Probably right there. It's a good spot. Mm -hmm. I might need more leverage, just a little bit. Biggest to smallest, nothing in between. how you work on it. The files are in the computer. In the computer. Gotta remove the compressor. I guess so. That's what he said. <laughs> Didn't drain the engine probably, right? Hey, well, guess we're gonna find out. If I was a betting man, I would say it has oil. You think it's got oil in it? I do. So I'm gonna go with there is no oil in it. Uh, I don't know, a lot came out of there instantly. Hey, Eureka. Unexpected. Time to change the oil. Yeah, yeah. He, he put a like a pry bar behind it and started moving it, and it just started pouring. Just started pouring out. Yeah. It was dripping. It wasn't pouring out. Chris is. I'm over exaggerating. Yeah. Oh, you want me to spin it? I didn't want to catch it in there. Wowzer. Get that oil out of there. Nice. How's it looking? <laughs> it looks great, dude. It looks like uh, looks like it's time to time an engine. It looks like it's time to time an engine. So we got those two guys, we got the chain. I don't think I got those two guys with that chain. Oil pump down there. Oil pump. Yeah. Looks like it's time to, I'll look up how to time one of these because I don't know how. Got the, got the new OEM chain? Yeah, it's a new OEM chain. It's a new OEM Mitsubishi timing chain. Straight from Mitsubishi and Japan. Right? Yep. Second time. It's a charm. Is there any links that are copper? Yeah. There, there they are. There they are. Oh, and they have them in like a group. Yeah, because right that's the top there. Okay. So that'll go in that little guide, right? Up here? Yeah. Yep, the four links are supposed to be in the guide up there, the four copper ones. Now, why is my chain on here don't have the copper links? Uh, That's what I'm gonna keep right? rotating it. 
No, it's li it should be lined up. Research complete. Timing started. No. 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 Wait, should we do the snap? No. No. Okay. No. No. Timing three. Thanks, YouTube, for telling me how to do the timing chain on an Evo 10. Now we're going to post the video of me doing a timing chain on YouTube, that where I just learned it but from. But you're putting the whole engine in, too. Yeah, that, so, too. So. And, I mean, and more things. There's parts to it, right? Yeah. I guess. Okay. Okay. All right, then. Okay, okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. okay. All right. Take care now. I didn't get a new guide. I don't know if you need one. I didn't know that was a thing. That one's probably okay, right? Probably. I mean, as long as it's not touching the chain. Beautiful tensioner. Old tensioner. Out with the old. Out with the old. This is just going to be an, uh, a whole video of you mocking me the yeah. entire time? Garbage. Garbage. This is the. Garbageo. It's just like a day in the life of. What happens when you come by the shop? I just mock everybody that comes by. Should I just pull this pin out right Instantly. now? Instantly. Uh, please do not. I just drop <laughs> the mic. Please do not pull the pin. So don't out, don't actually. pull the pin right now. No. Okay. That would not be good. It's so tempting though. Like, look at it. Mm, like where? I don't like where your brain's at. So we took it apart to inspect it, but we didn't like how it looked. It looks like they used some sort of aftermarket chain, maybe. Marks there and there and up there and over there, but we don't see any copper marks. So maybe it's an older the chain. Links. Copper links. Yeah, copper links. So they marked these with like a paint marker. Yeah. So either it's an aftermarket chain or it's like a OEM 08 boy. So we're going to update it. Cool. New. My phone is ringing. Ooh. Oh. Around your neck. No thanks. It's all oily. You can put it around your neck though. Come here. Bling bling. Yeah. Nice chain. I got two of them. We could call you two chains, right? Wait, do you have 222 of them to call me 222 chains? No. Okay. I do not. New chain. Does it have to face a certain way? That's got to be towards us, right? All the copper links towards us. Yeah. Pretty foolproof. Pretty foolproof. It's actually really easy. I like that. Compared to a VR4, <laughs> which is not so easy. Yeah. You're going to have to do two of those uh, at some point for me. Yeah, it's <laughs> going to be quite awful, actually. <laughs> Let's check it out. Yeah. Okay. I need to rotate that cam a little bit because it's off. <sighs> I wish I would have knew better to get get the oil pump chain with the guides too, but oh well, I guess, huh? Yeah, I mean, you looked up the parts and it looked like it was just I didn't, those. I didn't really research this very yeah, well. Yeah, it, just, it just looked like it was those parts. Well, I mean, this was all pretty... Hey, you want to build an Evo? Sure. Immediate, an immediate choice. Yeah, I was like, hey, uh, we need a project that you can complete for the YouTube channel and start driving and working on this car. And you're like, yeah, I'll just do the, the Evo 10. Yeah, let's pull that turd out of the lot and just to just get the parts in that moment. So there was no research. It was just here's the parts for the timing chain. And that was it. That was it. But next time, uh, these ones down here for There's the There's research that should have been oil. done. Yeah, a little more research. Well, if I can do it, you can do it too. And you too can be a mechanic. All you gotta do is put your mind to it. Break that fourth wall. <laughs> it's a little slack. Needs the other plastic guide. Yeah, what I think. Probably the best. 
I just want to hand tighten these. Ugh. Just hand tighten them for now? Yeah. I right, look at the torque spec on them because I have no idea what they torque to. You work on one car, you can work on them all. Pokemon. Right. What? I, I said, if you work on one car, you can work on them all, not collect them all. <laughs> but I do a good job at that too, though. Yeah. You're kind of like the Pokemon card man. <sighs> oh, almost went in the oil. I thought I was going to drop it in the oil. That's funny. thought that was Asta La Vista. Well, I'm no mechanic. But, but I play looks, one on but, YouTube. Yeah, but I play one on YouTube. And this looks good to me. So we're going to send it, put it back together, and then put it in the car. Yes. In the road? Can catch? Yeah. I'm putting it in with just, uh, just that. Uh, Did it get slack? Oh, you already pulled the pin? Yeah. Because it, it was just going to bind up with the slack that was in the, oh. in the chain. Yeah. Unlike the VR4 is how you can rotate it before you pull the pin. Yeah. Oh, it's 180 out. Oh, because it's not. Because it's got to go on those marks. So there's that one on time. There's that tiny mark. And then right there, right? It's got to be it's right there. That should be I it, can't right? I see that other one, the oil. Right there, see it oh, now? Oh, they're, clo they're close. It's on a gasket, it's like RTV. You don't eat Burger King? <laughs> you. <laughs> it's, it's lunch time. Dinner time. Oh, you gotta show the hamburger. Yeah, it's actually, uh, Whoa. It's actually hey. Taking a quick dinner time break. Be a midnight snack, actually. This tool doesn't do a great job. You know that? Hear that noise change? Yeah. Getting debris all in the engine, it's great. Yeah, I gotta get to go through and kind of clean it out. A little yeah. Bit. So, can I do this pan too? Yes, please. Please do that pan, Pam. It's all about the Benjamins. Gotta keep hundos. I haven't seen one in such a long time. <laughs> it's cause you're all with that digital currency there, bud. Anytime I see hundreds, they go to you. <laughs> really? Wow, I like that. So it's always a sad moment for me. <laughs> but I guess not so sad. My happiness outweighs the sadness, I guess, so, for now. To get buyer's remorse. You put some of those holes are in the inside, right? Uh, the yeah, bottom two? Yeah, two. Yeah, yeah, right there. Shiny. That one too? Me amor. You love? 
All right, looks good. Good job, good job, guys. Huh, Cleaning wow. it up. Oh, oh, underneath there. <laughs> Is it gonna? I don't even think it's. It's not. It's not gonna, it's not gonna fit. It's not gonna fit across. Oh. You gotta take that off. Yeah. It's a twenty-two. Nice. Nice. I do not have the torque specs. I just want to get some bolts in there. Ah, oh, good, good. Say what bolts are what? I have no idea because I throw <laughs> them all in here. Just throw them all in, in a vial. They're really tens or tens or twelves or twelves. They all do have different torque specs though. Uh oh, I don't think that's. That's how. I just slid more on. <laughs> it's my car. If it, it was somebody else's car, you know what? More. Yeah. Those must be 14s. I think yeah, that's, that's where the motor mount goes. Oh, those are where the motor mount goes? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, that makes sense. Are they all the same spec? All the 12s are. What about the ones in the center? Uh, those are 14s. That one was a weird 12. I don't even know if I had to take that out. There we go. Okay, love you. Bye. Love you, bye. See ya. Wrong one. Ooh. That almost went for a swim. Same. Come on, cameraman. Somebody. Sorry. He says, here's the bolts. I'm going to dangle it in front of your face. <laughs> yeah, while he's holding yeah. it. In. Hey, look at These are the bolts. <laughs> Get one over there. <laughs> well, the 12s are in certain spots. So. Well, those are for the bracket, I think. I go uh, down there. Uh oh, I was doing it just to hold this one. Seal up that motor and make it look awesome. That pan looks awful. I'm going to have to buy a new one. This one? Yeah, I wouldn't run it for too long. Get a new oil pan. Oh, this one does not want to cooperate. I don't like it. I don't like that bolt. It does not want to cooperate. Twelve mils get twenty-two foot pounds of torque. So it cannot be it. It's the same color as the pan. Rust. And then there's two short ones. Is that a yabba dabba do or a cowabunga? <laughs> what time is it? Probably almost 11 30. Oh. <sighs> yeah, good job. <laughs> nice work. Nice work. There. Lift it from over there. And I'll take this all out. Okay. <sighs> Keep going. Keep going. There you go. Wow, well, that was easy. Where? Yeah, even. Is it? At least the one I Dude, did you ever try the Del Taco like mango chicken or whatever? The honey mango chicken or something like that? It's a taco? Oh man, it was like my favorite thing. But that's got a full titanium exhaust on it too. This one was like there you go. As well. 
I'm going to throw a sealant back in your box that way you got some. Is that a good spot for it? Here, let me get that out of there. I'm just going over the bolts again just to make sure. Oh, I can't believe all that RT sealant got onto that spot right there. Oh my gosh, it's just. <laughs> so dumb, dude. <laughs> That was dumb. <laughs> Here's your spray tool. All right, that's it for today. <clears throat> All right, Rodney. Successful engine. Timing. Put, timing for reseal. the day. reseal. Day Hold one. Up. Day one. Day one, chapter one, season two, episode three. I don't know. That's good. It's good enough. We'll see you tomorrow where we put the engine on the subframe in the car, right? Maybe, yep. I don't know. I thought we were gonna be further along today, but clearly not, clearly not. Well, I had to do the timing, so not bad. I had to uh, take our time with the timing. <laughs> nice, pun. Yeah, you know, got to do it right. Yep, don't want to pull it out twice. That's what she said. <laughs>